This video is brought to you by, AE Juice. Get ready to use professional and easy to use transitions and presets, you can get them individually or you can get it in a bundle. Check out the first link in the description. Hello guys, welcome back to my another After Effects tutorial, in this After Effects tutorial, we are going to create this. Here you can see, I have imported all the files required for this project, you can download them from below link in the description. Complete After Effects project is available on my web store. Now let's see how to create this logo reveal, create a new composition, I will name it as logo animation. Set time duration to 7 seconds. Now let's add logo to the timeline. Scale your logo if needed, here I will scale my logo. Now let's add map media file to the timeline. Scale it to 50%. Now in effects and preset, search for motion tile. Add it to the map media file, for motion tile, select mirror edges, set output width and height to, 200. Now pre-compose it. Here I will name it as map. Select move all attribute into new composition. Let's also pre-compose the logo layer, name it as logo. For map composition, change track mat to, alpha mat logo. Now for map composition, in effects and preset, search for CC glass. Add it to the map composition. For glass, in surface, change bump map to, logo. Change property to, alpha. Set softness to, 10. Height to, minus 20. Displacement to, minus 500. Now in effects and preset, search for CC blobblies. Add it to the map composition. For blowiness, set blob layer to logo. Property to, alpha. Set softness to, 200. Make sure you are at start, now create keyframe for softness. Now at one second. Change softness to, 80. Now at 2 seconds and 15 frames, set softness to, 0. Press U to view keyframes, for end keyframe, change keyframe assistant to easy ease. Now set cut away to, 0. You can see the preview, perfect. Now let's make it golden. Create a new adjustment layer. In effects and preset. Search for tritone. Add it to the adjustment layer. Now here you need to set the color as shown, to get perfect golden look for your logo. Perfect. Now select all the layer. Pre-compose them. Name it as, Golden Logo 1. Perfect. Now let's create duplicate of this Golden Logo composition. Now open Golden Logo 2 composition. For map composition. For blob lies, here we will create keyframes for cutaway. 
Now at 2 seconds and 15 frames. Create keyframe for cutaway. Now at start, here I will set cutaway to 90. You can increase or decrease this value depending on your logo. Perfect. Now let's add this golden logo to composition 2, logo animation composition. Here we will place it at 15 frames. You can see the effect. Now let's create 3 to 4 duplicates of this golden logo 2 composition. Now let's place them at distance of 10 to 15 frames from each other. Here I will again create a duplicate. Place it at 3 seconds. Now select all the compositions. Now pre-compose it. I will name it as Liquid Logo. Perfect. Now let's create a new solid layer. This will be our background layer. Now in effects and preset. Search for gradient ramp. Add it to the background layer. Now here you need to set the start and end color for the ramp. You can set any color of your choice. Set ramp scatter to 500. Perfect, place it below logo composition. Now let's create a new adjustment layer. In effects and preset, search for camera lens blur. Add it to the adjustment layer. For camera lens blur, add near about 1 second and 15 frames. Create keyframe for blur radius. Set blur radius to 0. Now at start, set blur radius to 40. Select Repeat Edge Pixels. Press U to view keyframes. Select End Keyframe, change Keyframe Assistant to Easy Ease. Let's slightly adjust the speed graph. Perfect. Now from project panel, add the flare media file to the timeline. Change mode to, add. Now add the particles media file. Change mode to add. Perfect. Now let's create a new adjustment layer. In effects and preset. Search for sharpen. Add it to the adjustment layer. For sharpen, set sharpen amount to 20. Now here we will change logo composition and particles media file to 3D. Now create a new camera layer. Perfect. Now create an null object. Change it to 3D. Now parent camera to null object. For null, press R to bring up rotation. At near about 3 seconds. Create keyframe for Z rotation. Now at start of the timeline, change Z rotation to, minus 10 degrees. Now select both keyframes, change keyframe assistant to easy ease. Now adjust the speed graph as shown. Perfect. Now press P to bring up position. Now at 3 seconds. Create keyframe for position. 
now at start of the timeline. Increase Z position value as shown. Now select both keyframes. Change keyframe assistant to easy ease. Now adjust the speed graph as shown. Perfect. Now again create a null object. Change it to 3D. Parent null 1 to null 2. For null 2, press P to bring up position. Now at start of the timeline, create keyframe for position. Now at end of the timeline. Change Z position as shown, I will set it to near about, minus 700. Now let's create a new solid layer. This will be our frame. Make sure color is set to black. Now double click on this rectangle tool to create mask. For mask path, change unit to percent of source. Set top to 10%. Set bottom to 90%. Select inverted. Now let's see the complete preview. Perfect, here our golden glossy liquid logo reveal is created. Thank you guys for watching this tutorial, see you next week with another awesome tutorial.